ഇവന്റെ വീഡിയോ നമ്മൾ കുറെ കാണുന്നു സ്പോക്കൺ ഇംഗ്ലീഷിന്റെ ട്രെയിനിങ് കാര്യങ്ങളൊക്കെ പറഞ്ഞിട്ട് ഇവൻ ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് സംസാരിക്കൂ അറിയൂലപ്പാ ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് പഠിക്കുന്നതുകൊണ്ട് ആർക്ക് വേണമെങ്കിൽ വീഡിയോ ഇടാലോ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് നിങ്ങൾ ചിന്തിക്കുന്നുണ്ടോ നമ്മുടെ കഴിഞ്ഞ വീഡിയോയിൽ വന്നൊരു കമൻ്റ് ആണ് കേട്ടോ നീ ആദ്യം ഇംഗ്ലീഷിൽ സംസാരിക്കുന്നത് എന്നോട് ഇംഗ്ലീഷിൽ ഒരു വീഡിയോ ചെയ്യാനായിട്ട് കാരണം എന്താണെന്ന് വെച്ച് കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ ഞാൻ ഇംഗ്ലീഷിൽ സംസാരിക്കുമോ എന്ന് അവർക്ക് അറിയില്ല അല്ലെങ്കിൽ ഞാൻ എങ്ങനെയാണ് ഇംഗ്ലീഷിൽ സംസാരിക്കുന്നത് അവർ കേട്ടിട്ടില്ല അപ്പം അതുകൊണ്ട് എനിക്ക് ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് സംസാരിക്കാൻ അറിയോ എന്ന് അറിയാത്തത് കൊണ്ട് എന്തിനു ഞാൻ ഇവൻ്റെ സ്പോക്കൺ ഇംഗ്ലീഷിൻ്റെ വീഡിയോ കാണണം തികച്ചും സ്വാഭാവികമായ ഒരു സംശയമാണ് അല്ലേ നിങ്ങളിൽ പല ആളുകൾക്കും തോന്നിയിട്ടുണ്ടോ അപ്പോൾ ഞാൻ വിചാരിച്ചു ഇതൊരു ബെറ്റർ ഓപ്പർച്യൂണിറ്റി ആണ് അല്ലേ So I'm taking this as an opportunity to clarify that this is how I'm going to talk in English or this is the way I'm, I used to speak in English. There will be n number of mistakes. If you are interested in finding the mistakes, yeah, this is a challenge for you to find out the mistake and come and below. The- When it comes to a speaking, I'll tell you one, any language is giving you a permission or, or giving you a freedom to speak a language with all the mistakes. Because only thing is that you have to make sure the guy who's listening to you or the audience to whom you are talking to like they have to understand what you are talking about that's all it's a quite simple thing it's a quite simple simple thing and to be frank i'll tell you one thing i cannot blame the guy who asked this question because whenever i go through the youtube i i, I search like this uh, spoken english video and then it's it's automatically coming spoken english video malayalam so i click on that when i have seen or go through all channels who are talking about english and i found that actually all those videos are in malayalam so i cannot blame the audience i cannot blame someone who is asking this question you speak in english man so let us understand okay this is the this is the how, this is how it look like when you when you studied in a malayalam medium or when you never went for any kind of spoken english training but still if you if you gain just gain the confidence level to uh, to speak a language with a minimum vocabulary with a zero grammar base uh, with just with a confidence this is the most important thing i would love to say that actually english is a language it's just a language to communicate it is not something an art or it is not something a thing that you have to master what do you mean by master like i'll tell you one thing if you go to a google just go to a google and search how many hours to learn a particular thing you can ask anything like a guitar or a violin or drums whatever it is or drawing anything maybe you can write okay how how, how many hours to speak a language usually it's it's going to come that the 10000 hours rule what do you mean by 10000 hours a rule 10000 hours a rule like you know it's uh, it is a rule that you have to master a particular thing like if you want to draw a thing you have to draw like a, the the great artist or if you want to uh, learn music you have to sing like yeshudas or you have to sing like uh, hari haran you have, so you have to you have to be into that level so this is the hours they are taking there okay it's it's going to take around 10000 hours for you to to reach that level but to be frank english is not an art it is not an art to to become the master you understand that thing right because especially as a south indian especially as a malayali we have a we have a wrong belief that okay if you want to speak english you have to speak like a native speaker i don't know what kind of belief is that because english is not an art as i told you it is just a communication option for you to convey your message to the others so this is the way i used to speak so you have to understand that if i can make a video like this you can definitely speak definitely this will give you a courage i'm sure about that you can think about okay if shiju thomas can speak english like this way why not i i, I can try because or i can i can follow the tips and tricks what this guy is giving on this videos and everything because he is showing that this is how it look like if you practice all these things yeah this is the way you can speak in english let me tell you a story two friends they went for a kind of marathon you know the fitness challenge is going on the marathon competition was there so they went for a marathon so after the marathon like after the run they saw that actually the the committee is giving free sunglasses to everyone who participated in the in the marathon so one of the guy he said okay why don't we go and collect that sunglass because it's free but the other guy said no look at man the the queue almost maybe 200 people are in the queue and you have to stay for maybe at least for now there are one and hour, one more hour to get the sun glass but the other guy said it's a free it's a free sun glass why not he said again no it's a long queue i don't want i don't want so what happened the other guy the guy who was interested to get the sun glass he went there and he sne- sneak into the line and he grabbed two sun glass and he is he, he's back and he gave one to the other guy and he was surprised how did you get this two and it's too fast 
ऐसे दरोज देर इज नो स्पेसिफिक रूल दैट ओके यू हैव टू बी इन द लाइन यू कैनॉट स्नीक इन और यू कैन टेक ओनली वन नो इट्स नॉट लाइक दैट एनी बडी हू पार्टिसिपेटेड दे कैन टेक वट एवर यू वन ओनली थिंग इज दैट इफ यू वेट देर यू यू कैन यू कैन हैव एन ऑप्शन टू पिक विच वन यू लाइक बट इफ यू जस्ट स्नीक इन एंड ग्रैप टू वट एवर यू गेटिंग यू जस्ट जस्ट गेट दैट थिंग राइट यू डोंट हैव एन ऑप्शन टू सेलेक्ट बट स्टिल इट इज फाइन इट्स अ फ्री सन ग्लास एंड यू गेट इट फ्री राइट द वे ऑफ थिंकिंग इज एक्सट्रीमली डिफरेंट दिस इज हाउ इट लुक लाइक सम ऑफ अस आर थिंकिंग अबाउट द लॉन्ग प्रोसीजर ओ माई गॉड दिस इज द वे आई हैव टू आई हैव टू प्रैक्टिस एंड आई हैव टू reach this level to start speaking same like someone who believe that okay i have to first i have to study the vocabulary then i have to study the uh, all the grammar rules and regulation then i have to start practicing the gra- uh, sentence structure then i have to i have to go through all these single step then finally I do, after like long like you know after maybe 5 years 6 years 10 years okay that day i'll start speaking in english this is how someone is thinking about the the guy who's in the story same like you know it's a long queue it's a long journey No, I don't want to speak English. But there are some other guys, the guy who sneak in and grab the grab the sunglass, same like me. I never stay in the queue. I never stay in the queue. That means I never went for a training. I never learned grammar. If you ask me a five simple grammar question, I'm sure all the five may be wrong. I'm not sure about the grammar. Even in this video, you can you can find lot of grammatical errors or grammar mistakes, whatever you you call it, whatever it is. But but If you ask me to talk to someone, anyone, man, anyone in this world, if you ask me to talk to them about a particular topic, I don't have to, don't hesitate to go there and talk to them because, because I'm not thinking in my in my mother tongue. I'm not thinking in Malayalam. When I have a chance to speak in English, like right now, I'm talking to you in English, right? I'm not thinking in Malayalam and I'm converting that into English and talking to you. No, you can see the speed or how I'm I'm talking about video. I believe this will give you. two options either you will think yeah this is fine man if this guy can speak like this for me it is more important that okay i have to i have to follow this guy i will try to implement or i will try to practice all the trips or the not trips all the tricks or tips what this guy is talking about in his videos and i'm sure if this guy can speak like this this guy is mean it's it's me <laughs> So if Shiju Thomas can speak like this, yeah, yeah, why not? I can also try. This is the one feeling. Another feeling is gonna come like a traditional Malayali feeling. I'll tell you what is a traditional Malayali feeling. Okay, I'll tell you an example. If you watch any videos, like you know there is one African guy. I don't know his name actually. I mean, there is one African guy. He used to make TikTok videos or Instagram videos about all all in Indian language, like especially like South Indian South Indian videos or South Indian movies, all the songs and everything. And we love that guy. We have see, I love this guy, man. You you speak Malayalam, you speak Tamil, you speak Telugu. We we really support any foreign any foreigner who try to speak our language. We support them. We never make fun. We say, "Nah, this is great, Sai. This is great, <laughs> great man. You speak." because we all like you you have my back you you can rock or you can you can do whatever you wanted to do because we have you you have all the support from my side but at the same time at the same time you have to listen carefully yeah? at the same time when a malayali or when a south indian try to speak a different language i'm i'm talking a foreign language it's not my mother tongue this english is not my mother tongue english is a foreign language it's like an alien to a normal person like me I I have no connection with that language. It is not related to my culture. It is not related to my vocabulary range. It is not at all related to the grammar structure of my mother tongue. It is entirely 360 degree opposite. But when I'm trying to speak in that foreign language, my own people who are with like you know who are in my place or who are in my my state, the own people, own set of people, they started making fun. They'll say, "Why you want to speak in English, man? Or look at your English. Why are you talking like this?" Your English is so bad. It's so boring. It's so Malu accent. But I, I acquired a confidence level to, to, to reply back. So what? What the hell, man? Who you want? I have the ability, or I have the confidence to speak. It's none of your business. It's none of your business. If I wanted to speak in Malu accent, yeah, I'll speak in Malu accent. You watch the, the great Jackie Chan, or the owner of this Ali Baba. Check, check how they are talking in English. they are talking in their english with the the heavy influence of their mother tongue 
you cannot see them talking like an american or an english or a or a uk citizen they will speak with a with a heavy influence of their mother tongue you can re- easily understand he is not talking like a european or a native speaker but he it's fine it's jackie chan it's ali baba they can speak right <laughs> so someone who is in that level if they are talking to you in a broken english you accept because they already prove in their life that okay they are something else they, so they can speak but someone who is not something in their life they are talking in a broken english you want them to break down you want them to you want them to know not to grow in their career you want you know as i told you know i have a limited vocabulary i'm i'm showing you all the limitations what i have i have a, i have maybe the number of words i know it's it's quite limited one more thing i would love to say that the you know every language shapes the way how you think you maybe you don't you don't get my point right for example in english we used to say he break the glass right he break the glass that means this guy break a glass break this glass but if you ask the a spanish guy someone from spain a spanish guy to explain the same thing in english for example he saw that actually one guy break the glass so a uk citizen or a us citizen he was standing there and he said he break the glass he break the glass and it was an accident to be frank it was an accident not purposefully he like by accident like accidentally he broke the glass so he said he break the glass so in english we used to say he break the glass just think about it if you ask the same thing to a spanish guy he would say the glass broken glass broken so we we'll say no it's not really matching oh, how can you say that the glass broken you have to say he he breaks the glass the spanish guy will say no if it is an accident if it is an accident according to the spanish culture you don't mention the name of the person or you don't mention anyone because as long as it's an accident it's not someone who is doing purposefully so it's an accident accident means it's an accident so no need to mention who break the glass no need to mention who did this you you understand the difference right so english is a language with a culture but when someone is with a different culture when they are talking in english definitely their culture or their language will affect the way how they think one more example i'll tell you if it is sun the suri bhagwan right it's a it's a male character in indian language in malayalam or tamil or telugu i believe it's a male character suri bhagwan but if you go to german it's a female character according to a german citizen sun is like a, it's a female character if you ask anyone from germany to explain the sun he would describe like a poet from germany to explain like a give a write a poem about a sun he would describe as a feminine character it's a it's a beautiful lady but according to us it's a masculine strong uh, uh, rigid uh, it's a great it's a male character right in spanish also it's male but in german it is female the same way like if you take moon according to us it's a male character according to a different language it's a female character if you take table chair car anything anything we describe it as a male or female so depends on the culture from where you are coming depends on the place from where you are coming you describe a particular thing in a different uh, gender right so that means that means even if i speak in english it is it may not be the same if i talk to a german if i talk to a spanish guy if i talk to someone from a different world they it it is it may be not not in the same way how i'm thinking right so the more you learn about the english the more you learn about the uh, the this language this language will help you to understand the cultural difference of uh, all these people so as a conclusion i would love to say that english is just a language for your understanding and this language will help you to understand the whole world to help you to understand the different cultural cultural differences between each nationalities or it is quite easy for you to communicate with a person who is from a different different background or it will increase your empathy level this is this is the most important thing like you know when you when you start speaking a different language you have the more capacity to understand different people 
or their emotions their feelings and uh, what they are going through right and this will give you a you know strong uh, strong improvement for your brain capacity because you you are training your brain to learn a new language or you are training or you are giving some instructions to your brain to think in a different direction than what you used to do for last past many years right when i'm talking in malayalam i'm i'm thinking in a different way when i'm talking in english i'm thinking in extremely different way or when i'm talking in uh, some other language yeah it's a it's a it's a different pattern or a different system right that i have to follow so i believe in this video it was clearly demonstrated that this is how i am speaking in english and i'm not sure whether you are happy or not i don't care this is the this is a honest reply from my side i don't care because i i will do all my level best to improve my ability to speak or improve improve my english communication and um, i think if you guys are okay if you guys are okay i would be happy to make malayalam plus english both both the videos and uh, if you want me to make videos like this definitely you have to leave a comment and uh, why don't you subscribe right i have seen that most of the most of the video views are coming from non subscribers like 70 percentage 60 percentage of the views are coming from someone who don't subscribes to my channel it's okay the views are more important not the not the subscribers but i'll tell you one thing i'm planning to reach 100k subscribers maybe by next year so if you uh, if you want to part of one of the 100 subscribers who help me to get the silver play button Yeah, that will be really great, and I really appreciate. Uh, I really appreciate that. And uh, leave you a comment. This is the most important thing. And if you like it, press the like button. If you don't like it, press the dislike button, because it's your it's your freedom of choice, right? You have the option to go for any of these things. Because you might say, Shiju, I I really appreciate the way you speak, but this is not the way I'm expected expected because I have to be. fluent like a native speaker then you have to follow someone who born brought up and who's a who's a foreigner like a us citizen or a uk citizen or you have to follow some other trainers who are much 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 better than me right take care bye bye